Hello, and welcome to this how-to video brought to you by The Offer Shop Incorporated. In this video, we will walk through the process of downloading a print driver for your Canon device on a Mac computer. Let's get started. In a web browser of your choice, navigate to usa.canon.com. On Canon's home screen, click on Support. In the search box, type in the model of the device you want a driver for. For example, I will be using an image runner C5550 in this video. Once you type in the model number, the site should auto-populate top products that meet your search terms. Select the model you have from this list by clicking on the product name. Scroll down the page till you see the section Software and Drivers. Click on Software and Drivers. Canon site should auto-detect the operating system you were using. However, if it does not, you can manually select it by clicking on Operating System and choosing your computer's operating system. In this case, Canon site has detected that I am using the Mac operating system. Canon site should also auto-detect the version of operating system you are using. If it does not, click on Version and select your computer's operating system's version from this list. In this case, Canon site did not detect my version, so I'm going to manually choose Mac OS Big Sur version 11.0. Once the site knows your operating system and version, it will populate the drivers that will work with your computer. Canon will first display their recommended driver for the product you are connecting to. This is usually best for a variety of applications. To download the driver you want, click on Download on the right side. Depending on your web browser, you may be prompted with a pop-up asking if you allow downloads from the Canon site. Click Allow. Now we can open the download file. You can either find the download file on your dock or in the downloads folder of your finder. Double click on the file you downloaded. In the new window, double click on the installer file. This file should look like an open box. Follow the instructions in the installer to add the driver to your Mac. Keep in mind, this does not add the driver to your list of devices. This will just add the driver as an available option. Later on, we will be adding the printer as an option. It is likely that you will be prompted to enter your administrator's username and password to authorize the computer to install the new driver files. Enter the information and click Install Software. After the installation is finished, you can click Close on the installer. If prompted to, you may choose to move the installer files to the trash, as they will no longer be needed. Now that the driver is installed, let's add the printer. Navigate to your system preferences by clicking on the Apple logo in the top left of your screen. Click on System Preferences. On this new window, click on Printers and Scanners. Click on the plus icon. Depending on your version of Mac OS and how your Canon device is configured, it's possible it will show in the list as a Bonjour device. You can add the device from the list, but it's possible an incorrect driver will be used or features of the Canon device will not be available. It is recommended to manually add the device. To do so, click on the second icon on the top of the window. In the address field, type in the IP address of your device. If you do not know the IP address of your device, you can check in the TCP IP settings of the device or ask your IT department. Under Protocol, choose LPD. In the Q field, Canon recommends typing in LP in lowercase. In the Name field, type in a name that you would like to use for this device. In this example, I will use Canon Copier 5550. Under Use, choose Select Software. This will ensure that we are adding the print driver that we just downloaded. 
In the pop-up window, you can scroll down to your device or in the search field, type in the model number of your Canon device. Click on the model number of your Canon device and click OK. Click Add. You have now just added the Canon device as an option in the printer list. Now, let's make sure the device is configured with the options of your Canon device. To do this, highlight the device you just added and click on Options and Supplies. Click on Options. To take full advantage of your printer's options, confirm that they are accurately shown here. Once finished, click OK. And now you're all set up to print to your Canon device. If you have any questions or need further assistance, feel free to contact us either on our website at officeshopinc.com or give our service department a call at 855-333-0100. Thank you for taking the time to watch this how-to video and we hope that you have a great day.